Hi everybody, I'm back here in my front porch with a new story called The Gruffalo. Some of you know it. It's by Julia Donaldson and illustrated by Axel Schaefer. The Gruffalo. Look at that, big woods. A mouse took a stroll through the deep, dark wood. A fox saw the mouse, and the mouse looked good. Where are you going, little brown mouse? Come and have lunch with me in my underground house. It's terribly kind of you, fox, but no, I'm going to have lunch with a gruffalo. A gruffalo? What's a gruffalo? A gruffalo? Why don't you know? He has terrible tusks and terrible claws and terrible teeth and terrible jaws. Where are you meeting him? Here by these rocks. And his favorite food is roasted fox. Oops. Roasted fox, oh my! Fox said, Goodbye, little mouse, and away he fled. Silly old fox, doesn't he know there's no such thing as a gruffalo? On went the mouse through the deep, dark wood. An owl saw the mouse, and the mouse looked good. Where are you going, a little brown mouse? Join me for tea in my treetop house. It's frightfully nice of you, Owl, but no, I'm going to have tea with a Gruffalo. A Gruffalo? What's a Gruffalo? A Gruffalo? Why don't you know? It has knobby knees and turned out toes and a poisonous wart at the end of his nose. Where are you meeting him? here by the street, and his favorite food is owl ice cream. Owl ice cream? To wit, to who? Goodbye, little mouse, and away owl flew. Silly old owl, doesn't he know there's no such thing as a gruffalo? On went the mouse. Through the deep, dark wood, a snake saw the mouse, and the mouse looked good. Where are you going, little brown mouse? Come for a feast in my log pile house. It's wonderfully good of you, snake, but no, I'm having a feast with a gruffalo. A gruffalo? What's a gruffalo? A gruffalo? Why don't you know? His eyes are orange, his tongue is black, and he has purple prickles all over his back. Where are you meeting him? Here by this lake, and his favorite food is scrambled snake. Scrambled snake, it's time I hid. Goodbye, little mouse, and away he slid. Silly old snake, doesn't he know? There's no such thing as a gruffalo. He's getting a little scared. A gruffalo. That's me being a little scared. But who is this creature with terrible claws and terrible teeth and terrible jaws? He has knobby knees and turned out toes and a poisonous wart at the end of his nose. His eyes are orange, his tongue is black. He has purple prickles all over him. I like that part. Have a little trouble turning the page here. Mmm, my favorite food, said the Gruffalo. You'll taste good on a slice of bread. Good, said the mouse. Don't call me good. I'm the 
the scariest creature in the deep, dark wood. Just walk behind me and soon you'll see everyone is afraid of me. <laughs> oh, sure, said the Gruffalo, bursting with laughter. You lead the way and I'll follow after. They walked and they walked till the Gruffalo said, I hear a hiss in the grass ahead. What animal makes a hiss? It's Snake, said the mouse. Well, Snake, hello. Snake took one look at the Gruffalo. Oh dear, he said, goodbye, little mouse, and slid right back in to his log pile house. You see, said Mouse, I told you so. Amazing, said the Gruffalo. They walked some more till the Gruffalo said, I hear a hoot in the trees ahead. Who makes a hooting sound? It's Owl, said the Mouse. Why, Owl, hello. Owl took one look at the Gruffalo. Boo-hoo! He said goodbye, little mouse, and flew right up to his treetop house. You see, said the mouse, I told you so. Astounding, said the Gruffalo. They walked some more till the Gruffalo said, I hear some paws on the path ahead. It's Fox, said the mouse. Why, Fox, hello. Fox took one look at the Gruffalo. Oh, help, he said. Goodbye, little mouse, and ran right back into his underground house. The mouse said, Gruffalo, now you see, everyone is afraid of me. By now my tummy is starting to rumble, and my favorite food is Gruffalo Crumble. Gruffalo Crumble, the Gruffalo said, and quickly as the wind, he turned and fed, fled. All was quiet in the deep dark wood. The mouse saw a nut, and the nut was good. The end. That mouse tricked that Gruffalo the whole time he was he outsmarted the gruffalo it's so fun to see stories that do that until next time i miss you i love you